Hey guys, Justin here. I'm in Suicide One Island Resort right now and on board 8X of CTB and now you guys guessed it, more MMCs. <laughs> Alright, on board 8X today, this is a uh, quote unquote express route again from Suicide One Island Resort here all the way to Happy Valley Upper Taihang Road which is where I think Union, I think there's one hospital We'll terminate right outside the hospital. Thank you so much, MLR Trains UYT, for this request here. Greatly appreciate it. So this route is gonna take the Guru Path up to Shao K Wan, and then takes Eastern Corridor, Island Eastern Corridor, cut Siren Ho, cut Taiku, and cut Quarry Bay, and we'll come back down at North Point, then take North Point, uh, Fortress Hill, Tin Hao. Causeway Bay, then head to Happy Valley to terminate. Which is actually a pretty long express route. According to the app, it will take 64 minutes. Total of around 36 stops. I think 36 stops is the correct number on board TL3015 here. So the sun is pretty bad actually today. It's actually very sunny. So according to the caption, X19. So this route originally, I don't think this route is actually a full day service route. I don't think so. Before there's a route called, actually no, this route is full day service before. It starts from Suicide One here and terminates at Happy Valley Lower. Yes, it originally terminates at Happy Valley Lower. While there's actually another route, which is called 19, I think, route number 19. That one goes to Happy Valley Upper and also from Suicide One Island Resort. So that's why at the end, eventually, they removed Route number 19 and extends 8X to cover the parts up to Happy Valley North, Happy Valley Upper. So that's why this route is X part of X19, and we'll do it. It's actually pretty bad right now, the sun. So Suicide One is past Chai Wan here. And another crappy MMC coming back for 8x right there. <laughs> now for Sisai Wan Island Resort is actually a big bus terminus. There's actually a lot of routes, including one of my favorite routes, which is Route 789. Next stop, Full View Garden. I'm the only one on the bus right now. For sure, there will be people boarding. So, we'll take around 16 stops. I think 16 stops inside Chai Wan and Shao Kei Wan area. And it we'll skips to North Point right away. For sure, there will be people boarding right here. This route is a very frequent route on weekends during the middle of the day. 10 to 12 minutes per bus. This is not too bad, actually. Now for Sisai Island Resort, like I said, Route 789 terminates there, we go to Admiralty. That one is really an express route. That one is the perfect example of an express route because it has like 9 stops and it terminates at Admiralty, right outside of Admiralty Station. So, which if you guys have watched the Admiralty Station video on the train channel, then you will know. So it really terminates right outside of Admiralty Station. Although the price for 789 is actually pretty high. This route is also not too low, $7 for this route. For seven eight nine, I think seven dollars ninety cents. So that's why, but that one is really express. Oh no, six eight two garbage wrap. So really, what like seven eight nine? It took me like less than twenty minutes just to get out to Admiralty for that video. So. If you like to take a mini bus from Suicide One to Chai Wan Station and then take MTR, for sure it's gonna go over 30 minutes. So that's why 789 is really useful that route. Because for 789 literally stops here at Full View Garden, stops at Suicide One Estate, 
goes forward a little bit, then immediately island eastern corridor right out to Wan Chai. <laughs> so basically, as soon as you touch a little bit of Chai Wan, it skips from Chai Wan all the way to Wan Chai. That's the power of 789 with the price. So that's why it's very good that route. Okay, eight eggs here, more people boarding. Here is Hayatam Siu Sai Wan Chin next stop. Siu Sai Wan Estate. Xiang Yi Zhan Xiao Xi Wan Chun. Now I took one on eight in here, of course, because as uh, the express cross harbor route that goes from cross, cross harbor tunnel straight to Shao Wan and Chai Wan area. So, Hayatam Hiu Chui Gai next stop Hiu Chui Street. Xiang Yijian Xiao Chui Jie. It's not too bad right now, the speed, but eh, definitely can be a little bit faster. Later on, it will be going up the hill, so that's why that hill is actually also very steep, so that's why. Now, hopefully, this guy goes faster during uh, Eastern Island, I mean, Island Eastern Corridor, not like that 18x driver last time. This bus is actually pretty cool because it has ads all over the bus with this, uh, I think it's a full bull. Yes, full bull. Oh gosh, what is the name of this? No English name for this, uh, for this uh, finance app. I think it's full bull or something like that, I don't remember. It's just a uh, whole ad covered bus. Quite a lot of people taking this one. Now basically right here, 8x, 118, and 789 will be the routes that most people take. Hi, <laughs> Ayatam Fu Sengok Next Stop Fu Sheng Court Xiang Yi Zhan Fu Cheng Ge I still remember last time when I ended at Chai Wan East with that 682. I walked back out here just to take 118. Got 788 back to Suicide Wan. That one's also pretty good, but that one goes to Central. Fair, uh, I think it's Fairy Piers. Or is it Macau Ferry? I don't remember. I think it's Macau Ferry or Central Ferry Piers. It's just either one. But uh, it takes a very similar path as 789, but just goes a little bit further. Next stop, Lokhin Terrace. Xiang Yi Zhan, Le Xian Tai. Actually, Le Xian Tai. Oh, missed the red light. Missed the light. Unfortunate.
Oh, we got a uh, training bus over there, and exhibition center station for route number eight, which started service at at uh, Heng Fat Shun. Yep, it's using a low height over there. I don't know why it needs to use a low height. <laughs> There's a white 8 coming over. Route 82. North Point Ferry Pier. To Suicide One, of course. Another low height for route number 8. Still don't get why they need to use low heights. Double 8P here. 1 AP, 2 APs. So this is, you can see right there, Enviro 400. It is not Enviro 500. This one we're on is an Enviro 500, which is pretty garbage. That one's Enviro 400, which is, Enviro 400 is one of my favorite types of buses. But I prefer the KMB ones because the end of the newer first bus one, the low heights, these are the low heights. They look pretty weird in my opinion. <laughs> Okay, here's Chai Wan. Fortunate the sun is directly in, some, in front of our eyes. Route 106 here. Another miserable route. Trying to block off the sun here. Oh my gosh, it's so hard to get rid of the sun. Gosh. Next stop, Wan Chui Market. I need the sun to get off my eyes. Okay, a better one over there, but it's still an MMC actually. Oh, another garbage minibus. Holy crap, that was so bad. Some reporting. Another low height for number eight. Why? <laughs> I really don't get this. Why number eight need to use low height? Doesn't even pass for any like mountain paths. Oh, I saw the uh, I saw Chang'an Station back there. Next stop, one Chak Chui House, one Chui Estate. I think I don't remember the pronunciation actually for that one. You want board? Of course. Like, I think actually we're gonna have to stop at every single stop because I bet every single stop there will be at least one person getting on. Packed with cross harbor routes here. So if you're actually crossing the harbor from right here at Chai Wan slash Suicide Wan, you just want to cross the harbor, not going any further than just crossing the harbor, don't take 106. <laughs> you're going to regret your life choices if you choose to take 106. So yeah, don't take 106 if you just want to go across the harbor from here. Take 118. Always take 118. 
so 118 is the express one which will cost you double the price uh, not double the price double the time if you take 106 oh my gosh oh my gosh the joy to the world here for this 118 nice b8l i took an mmc over here so i'm sorry <laughs> 下一站,輕華村卓華樓 Next stop, 卓華 House, 輕華 State 下一站,輕華村卓華樓 Return right here Looping 輕華 State a little bit here Next stop, Feng Hing House, Hing Hua Estate. Next Here's Feng Hing House right there for Hing Hua Estate number two. Afterwards, we head up the hill, and we missed the light though, unfortunately. These are the old housing estates here in Hong Kong. You can see, very old. They're not fancy at all. So, but it's just because Hong Kong is just lack of space, too dense, it's lack of space. So that's why, no matter what it is, old as older generation estates or the new built estates is all gonna be high rise buildings. You see, this is also an old one. You see how tall this thing is. Another stop for Hingwa State, and we head up the hill to Shao Kei Wan. 118 over there, 106, a double 106 here. One by New World First Bus, the second one back there is by KMB. Oh, we got number 8 turning back out. After looping inside to Taiwan Station, look back out, ready for Exhibition Center Station. And we missed the light again. Wow! What an un, un what a un, what an unfortunate turn of an event. We got a low height for eighty one. Terminates at Hengwa Estate. That's so weird, these low height buses. Oh, uh, it's not, probably not our turn. It is blinking, but probably that side first. Yep. Yep, there goes that number eight. Is that weird, these looks? It doesn't look correct. <laughs> Already 18 minutes, not even left. Try one yet. Wow. Next stop, Star of the Sea Catholic Church. Next stop, Next stop, Hingman State. The hill here. This is a must pass through path if you don't want to take Island Eastern Corridor right away. So. Oh, looks like a uh, city bus driver is boarding here. Is that city bus or newer first bus? That looks like city bus to me.
more low height for number eight. Wow, why? Hang for chin. Oh, the uh, the bus driver boarded, and then he decided to actually sit right behind me. Why? Next stop, Shanchui Court, Eastern Hospital. What is that minibus? That looks like a. Uh, L S Olympic uh, LPG one. EV eighty two. Wow, that's pretty cool. So that's how you can see. Although there is a uh, there is a bus driver actually sitting right next to me, right behind me. Actually, he is. He's literally sitting right behind me, and he saw actually my phone for sure. He had that in filming, but he didn't do anything. He just let me go. You see, he didn't even do anything. So that's why this is the one thing that I like about Hong Kong bus drivers. Like most of them, if you don't affect the driving, they won't care about you actually whether you're filming. So that's why. Got a Tai Tam Road here. If you turn up Tai Tam Road, it's going to Stanley for route number 14. Or you can go to Shek O with route number 9, which also takes that path. But for route number 9 and route number 14, they all will be using low high buses. Because for real, because up there is off the mountain paths. So that's why low high buses are required to take Tai Tam Road. If you use the normal height, it exceeds the height limit for the uh, vehicles that actually pass through, so that's fine. Next stop, Shao Kei Wan East Government Secondary School. Oh, first stop ever. No stop, no one getting on. Next stop is Akonam Road, then North Point using Island East Corridor. Next stop, Akonam Road. So, upcoming is actually a very funny bus stop because for the next stop, Akonam Road, all bus drivers are required to stop at the bus stop. You cannot skip it. You have to drive in and wait for like two, one to two seconds. If no one board, then you leave. But you have to stop. You cannot skip the stop. You have to stop. I don't know why they actually require that, but for the next stop, all buses have to stop, then keeps on going. Instead of just skip the stop and run straight through. See, you see that number eight turning in, and we also will be turning in, even though no one is actually made, no one may board. Might not. You see, this guy literally number eight, no stops, no one getting on. You look at this, look at that. Compulsory stop. Yep, no one board. We we'll leave now. I don't really get why it's a compulsory stop, but oh, missed the red light. Unfortunate. Next is 
Island Eastern Corridor. Next stop is in North Point. Next stop, Healthy Gardens. Now, there will be change of fares for this route. We will change to four those twenty cents, I think, later on, but not yet. Got a lot of minibuses coming in. All of those are pretty garbage. So if you keep going down to take Shaoke Wan and Kori Bay, you take down there. Which Route 106 will go down there? And keeps taking the local path. But we'll take Island Eastern Corridor. Which goes this way and skips most of the stuff. There's Shao Kewan bus terminus. Oh, it looks like change of fares. Yeah, change of fares. Next stop, change of fares. $4.20. Checking my phone to look at the price. Okay, this guy's driving pretty good right now with a decent speed. And it is checking us $4.70, okay. Oh, we'll change to $4.20 later on. <laughs> so we have $4.70 and $4.20 when we hit Causeway Bay. Looks like round number 8 also takes Eastern Corridor. Pass through the entrance of Eastern Harbor Crossing. So Eastern Harbor Crossing, that one, goes down and cross harbor right away. We're not going that way, so keep going. Eastern Harbor, uh, I mean Island Eastern Corridor, keep going. We're we'll turned down very soon, unfortunately. We're almost at North Point. And then after that will be Nightmare, because King's Road. Oh my gosh, it looks pretty bad actually. Eastern Harbor Crossing, jamming pretty hard here. Made it to North Point. Let's go down now. Now, of course, you can keep taking Eastern Corridor and even use One Chai Bypass. To keep going straight through the oh my gosh another one of these like this so 
basically for Island Eastern Corridor, it basically you can actually connect all the way from Kennedy Town to Taiwan. Basically, that's you can work like that because with uh, Kennedy Town, you can go up to I think it's a Western Corridor. You take Western Corridor and it goes to around Central Ferry Piers. Then you go down to Wan Chai Bypass, which straights to connect Island Eastern Corridor, and you can keep going from there. That's why no worries of actually having it to jam under here. So, if you're driving normal private cars, but of course when you take buses, that's another different talk. It took us three minutes just to get from Chao Kiwan over here. That's why if you're just taking from Akongam Road to right here to get off, it's very quick. You see, just three minutes, you can just get off and done with it. But I'm taking full journey, so that's why. If we turn left, we'll go back to the east side. We keep going this way to go to the west side. Word for these guys is like something scrapers. Like something scrapers, but I forgot the word, damn it. Road scrapers? I don't really know that one, but yeah, that's a better term. The worst term will be will be beggars. Next stop. Island place. Okay, there goes that bus driver. He went down already. Hopefully, he just goes out instead of actually uh, notifying the driver. Oh, he got off normally. We got another B8L for 619, which is very decent. WT3070. That's a pretty decent one. See how packed that thing looks. I really like the B8Ls, one of my favorite types of buses. And okay, now we just basically take the whole thing. Next stop, Metropole Building. Not too many boarding actually. Not too many people actually on the bus for this one. I saw some 8x passing through when I took the 118 earlier on, and there are like tons of people on those, like packed. Not full, but packed. More MMCs on the way here, of course. Route number 10. Nightmare route, this is nightmare, nightmare 10. Goes from North Point all the way to Kennedy Town, taking this no old path. Very cheap, very cheap, $4.20. But don't take the full journey. It's just for you to take a few stops. Don't take full journey for that one. And hopefully you guys don't request route number 10 because it will be boring for you guys to watch. Now, the request form has closed of course again, and I have chosen already one request 
from the bunch of requests that you guys have left of me, if you guys have. I don't know actually because when I film when I'm filming this video, the form is not open yet, so that's why. That's why, but I will choose one out of the amount of requests that actually you guys gave me, so that's why. So that's why who will be the lucky guy? I don't know. But I will open up the form for a, a, around a few days and I will choose one. It's not gonna be first come first serve this time because I want to choose the best request out of all to finish film that one as my route as my 20th route for this stay in Hong Kong. I'm going back to Perth in two weeks, so uh, not feeling it at all. Not feeling Perth at all still. Next stop, Chung Hong Street. For your own safety, please bow the handrail while standing or moving in the bus compartment. Here's the Cheung Hong Street stop. Anyone getting on? Yes, there is. The price is honestly not too bad. So there are two routes that terminates at Happy Valley Upper Tai Hang Road. This is two things, okay? Happy Valley Upper Tai Hang Road and Happy Valley Upper. This is two stops, completely different stops. Happy Valley Upper is for route number one to terminate and for route number 8x and route number 19p this is just a special route that has one service during school days at seven o'clock departs from Shao K1 one stop I think 19 19p goes from Shao K1 to Happy Valley Upper Taihang Road but one bus every single day during weekdays seven o'clock in the morning and that one also terminates at Happy Valley Upper Taihang Road but technically that means only one route terminates at Happy Valley Taihang Road. But no worries because nearby Happy Valley Upper Taihang Road bus stop, there is another bus stop which is called Woodland Heights. I think it's that stop which has a bunch of other routes that I can take later on, so that's why. Which include the route 1M which I think I'm gonna take later on. Because it's the best route. Yes, it's the best route. 1M or route number six. These two are the routes that I'm gonna choose, but probably most likely will be 1M because 1M goes to Exhibition Center Station, while number six goes to Central and passes through Wan Chai. Which, of course, if I take number six, I'll get off at Wan Chai and change to Cross Harbor buses, which includes Route 109 and 113. Those are miserable to wait for, so that's why I don't want to do that. 1M goes to Exhibition Center Station, which also gives me a discount if I take Israel Line after that. So of course I would take one end. And that's a new route which I've never tried, so that's why I would just try that one. And they're gonna use the low height buses so I can sit at the front of the drive, like right next to the driver. That would be awesome. Ah yet dam Pao Tai San Dam Next stop Fortress Hill Station. I will film Fortress Hill Station very soon actually for the train channel. Again it's a very boring station. The 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 score will be very low again. So the MTR station series we have begun it has it has begun but uh, it will continue after I return to Perth. Okay. My target is to pre-record 26 episodes which I think 1 to 2 should have already gone up and premiered. So I will premiere them weekly then I can hopefully survive longer for the series before it has to call a quit until I come back next year. Okay, this looks pretty bad here. Ah, yet dam Ting Fong Gai. Next stop, Ting Fong Street. Next Ting Fong Street. My thumb is pretty painful right now because I use keep using my thumb to actually hold the phone. One o two here to Mei Fu.
again the same situation where we just hit a yellow light and changed to red. It's been like five to six times already throughout the journey that I've taken so far. Got Ting Fung Street stop at the front. I think changing fares again. Six seven three. <laughs> One of the most expensive normal KMB routes. Yes, normal KMB routes. One of the most expensive. WM five oh seven, another B eight L, which is pretty decent. V six B. And uh, what what do I mean by most expensive routes? That one costs twenty five dollars sixty. Yes, because it goes from Sheng Shui all the way to Hong Kong Station. So that's why, of course, it's going to be expensive. Twenty five dollars sixty is the is the most expensive for normal bus routes. Now, there are special routes that start from race course. Those can be routes can cost up to $50, but those are not normal routes. That's why. 670, 30 minutes per bus, but it's a normal route. I filmed that one actually, so you can check that one out. But I did the other way. I did from Hong Kong to Sheng Shui. Hopefully, oh, again, this is the sixth time or the seventh time now. Again, the light turns red in front of my face. Oh, we actually got a tram to Happy Valley. <laughs> nice, we got a tram to Happy Valley here. So, but for uh, trams, their terminus for the trams at Happy Valley is at Happy Valley Lower, which is right next to Happy Valley Lower bus terminus. But we'll go to Happy Valley Upper, which is up in the hill, so that's fine. Let's check out the price, which I think should have switched. Yep, just switched at Ting Fung Street for those 20 cents. Next stop, Queen's College, Victoria Park. We turn right actually at the front or something. Oh, no, 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 no. I think we take the main path. No worries. Here's Queen's College, one of the best colleges in Hong Kong here. Goes to Awafu and Chifu. Ayatam, Modern Toy. Next stop, Modern Terrace. Modern Thai. Next stop, Modern Terrace. Hong Kong Central Library. Okay, the sun is back. Almost at Happy Valley. Got route number 11 turning out. Single decker exclusive for that route. Red light. Okay. 
Oh, while we're waiting, let me edit the uh, thumbnail picture real fast. Perfect. Thumbnail set. Trash these things. And perfect. Now we just wait for traffic jam to leave. Oh, this run, this run actually stops here. It's actually pretty cool that this run actually stops here. Well, also, also means another thing. Red light at the front again. Damn it. For sure, it's gonna change red right in front of my eyes again. Yep, again. Called it. Yeah, I just get unfortunate with the red lights today. Uh, we're not gonna turn left here, actually, we're gonna go straight and go left. Next stop, Caroline Hill Road. Oh, I saw a woman eight, and uh, not woman eight. I saw one eight actually at the back there turning. You guys may be thinking, where the hell can you see one one oh eight? It's like nothing here. I can see through the bushes right through there you can see some traffic at the back there that's where I spotted that it can be which turns right there which only one run one route 108 actually goes there so that's why so you see one 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 two here go across the harbor we'll take the right we'll lean left here Oh my gosh, but when we lean left, this is what we get. This is what we get. Nightmare. Is it double one one two here? Looks like it is. Yeah, we got nightmare after we turn here. Do we turn right or we just keep going straight? I think we keep going straight, so that's why it's gonna be a big problem. Definitely need to wait for a few rounds here. Now for sure the traffic inside Happy Valley is not going to be that trash, but... Well, there's a, actually, I already know why it's actually so bad right now, the traffic, because there are like how many illegal parkings right here. Basically, there are already three illegal parkings right here. And there's more right here and that truck is also going to illegal park right there they're definitely away for one more round that's for sure and also because they're like driving drive learning again here I hate this area So there are actually like three overall three spots you can actually learn how to drive. One is actually in Ho Man Tin, one is in Sha Tin, and one is over here at Happy Valley. Maybe in Yao Tong, but I don't think so. The most common one 
the most common three spots are Ho Man Tin, Happy Valley right here, and the third one is in Sha Tin. Look at this crab, wow. And there's also bad design, why actually this light turns green first? Why not the one at the front turns green first, then this one turns green? Because these guys, as soon as they move forward, they have to stop again. Terrible planning again. Layton Road here. Unfortunately, we still haven't stopped at the Caroline Hill Road stop. Here's the stop. Tons of people boarding. Which also means red light again. Yep, there it goes. Five B turning right, turning out here to Kennedy Town. Oh, looks like actually. Did C Learn actually took a picture of that bus and sent it to me yesterday? He said he took one. It looks like that one. I get down. I I think it's correct. Is it that? Let's just check it out. Hi, Tom. Layton Junction. Next stop, Layton Center. Next stop, Layton Junction. Finally, we can leave this forsaken path. Next stop, Leighton Centre, Times Square. Go, go, go. Go, 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 go. Ooh, that's close. <laughs> Made it. There's Lee Theatre Plaza, which next to Times Square. Oh gosh, the sun is back. There's the stop at the front. Still traffic jam though. Next stop, Sports Road. Next Here's the tram coming in to Happy Valley.
This is the only path into Happy Valley. Lockwood Road. Next stop, Broadwood Road. Next stop, Broadwood Road. Next stop, Amigo Mansion. I really like the English for this one, Amigo. <laughs> like, see you, Amigo. Spanish, of course. It means friends, I think. You know what? Next is Happy Valley Lower Bus Terminus. Next stop, Happy Valley Lower. Which route number 117 for Cross Harbor Route terminates here. And we're gonna keep going to Happy Valley Upper. This is not the terminus, so we keep going. You see 1M also passed through, so later on we take 1M. It will turn us back down right here. But for Happy Valley, the paths are all one direction only, so that's why if you want to go back out, you have to take the front path. We we'll just turn left right here, actually. Next stop, Yik Yam Road. Next stop, Yik Yam Street. No, 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 no. Next stop, Yik Yam Street. Oh my god, I suck. That's okay, the pronunciation is almost correct. We're almost at the time, there's six more stops. This is 31, so five more stops to 36. Which is up the hill again, so... You can hike in Happy Valley, honestly, from lower up the way, all the way up to upper. It's actually pretty fun, I've walked once, actually. It's pretty steep actually. If you take this path, it's not as steep as the path next door. I took the path next door last time and it's so steep. Oh! Again! Next stop, Xingping Mansions. We got an 8x back. I think that's, that's not the original one. That's not the one I saw earlier on. I let it go. I saw another one which is also crappy MMC earlier on left because I was not ready to film so that's why I just let the bus go that's how I always do if I'm not ready for filming don't take the bus that's all now I just don't want to rush myself and get onto the bus and not having everything filmed perfectly one hour and one minute too many red lights we just stopped at way too many red lights so that's why I ended off not really that efficient this time Thank <laughs> you. 
No red lights here, which I appreciate. Really appreciate no red lights. Someone's getting off here though. Oh, there's so many dogs here. That's so cute. That's how I always like to actually pronounce, like how to actually like sound like dogs. When I'm next to some dogs, I'm just gonna go <coughs> like that. So I try to get their attentions because they're so cute. Oh, that's so cute. Up the hill. Someone's still here though. Next stop, Green Lane. Okay, there's number one, which it terminates at Happy Valley Upper, not the Tai Hang Road that we're gonna do. Return left. Oh, no, 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 not yet, not, not, not left yet. We're gonna keep going first. Now, I'll show you where number one terminates there later on. This guy's rushing to get this bus. Which I filmed round number one as one of my first, actually not my, one of mine, is exactly the first city bus route that I have filmed for the start of the bus channel is route number one. So we keep going up, you see how steep this thing is? Route number one, it terminates right here. This is where Route number one terminates, right there. You see there's a stop right over there. That's where it terminates. We're gonna keep going. Next stop, Villa Dorada. And two more stops and we're at the terminus. Next stop, Billion Terrace. Next stop, Billion Terrace. We're getting off, yes. This is the bus stop in the middle of nowhere. And next stop is the terminus, which I think is just actually up there. <laughs> I'm the only one on. Hopefully someone's gonna get off at the hospital, which is up there with me. This is so steep. Next stop's terminus. Next stop, Next stop, Happy Valley Upper. Happy Valley Upper. Here we are, made it. Where's the bus terminus? Not here. Later on, I'm going to walk up there to take 1M actually. Wow, this path is pretty lame. Here we are. We can do that. Don't dim down. Think me, hoi, tia, shong. Bye bye. Made it. Happy Valley Upper.
Why this bus is still moving? What the hell? We're already there. Just open the doors. Alright, made it! And today is one of the hottest days. I'm not even joking. Today is like 26 degrees. Oh my gosh. But anyways, Happy Valley Upper, which is actually having the pretty good views. I actually need to figure out where to go later on. So I'll see you guys next time. Remember to like and subscribe. Click the bell so that you can get notifications when I post. Check out the links in the description down below for my other channels and my Instagram. Click on these videos up top and I'll see you guys next time. Peace!